Hey everyone, this is AVJV Gaming, bringing you guys episode number 68 of this Black Ops 2 Emblem tutorial. And as you guys can see up on screen, we have a subscriber request, which is for the badge of NK Maribor. So for those of you guys who probably are wondering Black Ops 2 Emblems, yes guys, I do create Black Ops 2 Emblems, um, and I will be doing them regularly again. Um, for those of you guys who are my Black Ops 2 Emblem subscribers and must be thinking, finally, um, yeah, I will be doing between one and four emblems today guys so I want you guys uh, this is gonna be the question of the day for the Black Ops 2 subscribers and for my FIFA subscribers who like these um, how many emblems would you guys like to see today would you like to see four emblems would you like to see three emblems two emblems uh, if you can leave a number down below I'm gonna do maximum four today because I just uh, need to get back into them so I'm just gonna do a warm-up sort of and uh, you guys let me know I have got all your guys requests I do know we got requests from uh, the Dutch League requests from all around the world pretty much. I've got some requests from Asia uh, for those um, K-League badges, uh, from Seattle Sounders, from the United States. Um, we got so many requests guys. I think I got from some from the Liga Portuguesa for Porto and uh, what's the other team? Benfica. We've got so many, we've got loads from the Empower uh, leagues as well, guys. So those will be uh, some I'm working on at the minute. I think we've also got some from the SPL. So yeah, guys, lots of requests and I will be working my way through those so we can hopefully have them all done very soon. But this emblem in the background, guys, I'll just quickly get to that one before I continue talking about all the emblems. Um, as you see, guys, in the background, we have a bomb protector, which is going to be our initial background layer. And then what we're going to do on the top of it is put a semicircle or a half circle that's going to work to make the actual initial shield. Then we're going to clone those layers over, uh, make them purple, and then do the same thing and make it yellow. Except for this time, we don't put the um, the actual golden -y yellow color as a half circle. We put a black um, half circle. And what you guys will see me doing now is I'm actually trying to make a banner. Because on this actual emblem, we actually going to have some writing there saying uh, Maribor. So what I'm doing over there is gonna put try to fill in the spaces and I you do use a I think it's called a flag no wind and then I'm gonna use a uh, second lieutenant um, and then what I'm gonna do is go grab the black semicircle put it back over the initial layers go down and change the color on the color picker to 204 160 and 0 so it looks perfect guys so those are the colors for those of you guys who are not too sure on the color uh, scale and that does work very nicely and then we got the initial background layer started. So now we're going to do is work on the detail in the middle. And firstly, we'll cover up and um, put, I think it's a rounded square, put the color back onto the same color as I did before, 204, 160, and 0. And that'll be about it. But yeah, uh, for those of you guys who are looking for your emblems, guys, uh, if you are new here and you are looking for an emblem, uh, check my playlist or just leave a comment down below. So if you're looking for United or Arsenal or any of those badges, let me know down below. And I'll, as soon as I get your message, I will send you guys a message back. Or if you guys want, uh, go into my playlist and there's lots of emblems I've made. As you guys can probably tell, I think there's around uh, 67 or 68 now. So uh, lots of emblems for those of you guys. And if you're new, um, subscribe and then just basically send me a message and I'll go and create it for you. So, for those of you guys who must be wondering, uh, why did I stop Black Ops 2 Emblems? And this is because I became very busy with the, with not being able to actually do that much on YouTube and just basically, Emblems take a long time to make for me. Um, initially, an Emblem takes, I look at an Emblem once I get the request, I go and write down every single layer that I have, 32 layers available, um, break down every single layer, and then what I do is I go and create the Emblem, which takes around half an hour. So you guys can imagine at the moment it's around an hour just to actually get the design, then to create it, and then afterwards I have to delete that, go and make the Emblem a, a time whilst recording, and then i got to come back and then um, do a commentary, render the thing up, and then upload it. So uh, I, I try to make sure that all the Emblems are up to what I'd say is a very, very high standard, because I do like to get these Emblems out to you guys as um, as good as I can get them but um, yeah guys uh, one thing I'd recommend for those of you guys who are possibly new to making emblems definitely 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 go and do those challenges because on black ops you know there's challenges for winning these certain um, layers on black ops one thing I'd recommend I might do a challenge lobby actually where we go and uh, basically go online go play search and destroy for an hour uh, play demolition for an hour do all these different challenges for an hour and then just basically we'll have all the different layers so when you guys want to go and create emblems you guys will know exactly which ones to do and the way by doing this guys is when you go in a team to actually play black ops you'll notice you get a lot more challenges done than being um, sort of a solo player 
So I don't know if you guys are up for that. Let me know as well. And uh, if you guys got me on Xbox, hit me up on Xbox. If you guys got me on PS3, I will try my best to get Black Ops because at the moment I don't have it. So uh, see how that goes. But guys, what I'll do is, uh, I don't know if I've spoken about the time scale for these emblems um, in the terms of me uploading them, but I'll try to get like four every time I, so every day I'll try to get like four, and it'll probably be most likely on Sunday and another day during the week. So I'll try getting four pretty much every day when I do upload. So there'll be two days in a week that I'll upload, and there'll be eight emblems out. Um, I think at this very minute, guys, we have around 20-something requests, 22 or 23 requests at the minute. And once those are done, guys, um, I'll start taking in more, lots more requests and um, doing, I think, what uh, subscribers initially asked me was for footballs from FIFA, how they've got the different designs, or then league crests. So uh, British Premier League crest, um, go for the Liga, BBVA, MLS, and all those sort of different leagues. I'll go and make those eventually. So... That sounds quite fun, and yeah, hopefully, guys, we'll get back into emblems a lot more because I've been finding them very interesting recently. I think I lost that sort of um, that sort of motivation to create emblems initially, and then I got so busy, and just the time scales of everything just really tore it down. But hopefully, guys, we'll get lots more out. So I think, guys, this is going to be it. I'm just writing the writing in over the top, and uh, one thing I'll tell you, guys, just as you see, clone them over as I've said before. I think in the past. Um, just change all the letters around and you're pretty much good to go because everything will be the same size font. But guys, if you do enjoy this, please do drop the video a like and subscribe, guys. And also let me know, guys, what requests you have so I can go and create them very soon. And uh, check out my other series, guys. I got a FIFA series where I do a lot of FIFA Ultimate Team stuff. And yeah, guys, I think this is going to wrap it up. So this has been AVJV Gaming and I'll catch you guys for the next episode.